Access to fast, reliable internet became very apparent during the pandemic, and at the height of working from home, the FCC established the Affordable Connectivity Program. This program gives households a discount on their home internet bill, but the program could now be in jeopardy. Two on your side's chief broadband correspondent, Nate Benson, joins us right now. And Nate, tell us what is happening with this program and who is it going to impact? Yeah, hey there, Lauren. Like all good things in life, it takes money to keep them going, and the Affordable Connectivity Program is running out of funding. The program launched in December 2021, and Congress allocated more than $14 billion for it. Those households that are eligible receive $30 each month towards their internet bill. The funding for the program is expected to run out in April unless Congress agrees to keep it going. So who is this going to impact? Well, about 163,000 households across the eight counties of Western New York. That means if Congress doesn't keep the program, your internet, could, internet bill could increase in May. I asked Senator Kirsten Gillibrand about the funding earlier today. Basically just have to fight to get more money. We have, it's appropriation seasons, season, so we have a bunch of appropriation bills that we're trying to get our language in. Right now, we're not getting to vote on it. For Republican colleagues in the House, I haven't been able to get Congressman Langworthy or Congresswoman Tenney on the record about whether or not they support the funding extension. We're going to have more on this tonight at 11, but if Congress doesn't act, there's 160,000 Western New York households who will be paying higher internet bills. On your side, Nate Benson, Channel 2 News.